Georgiana is going to change things for the better because it's going to offer a new destination within Saudi Arabia and the region. We are developing a region that is architecturally ambitious, futuristic, and integrating it with beautiful landscape, but doing it in a responsible way. I am Nadim Dizar. I'm part of the development team at Trojena. I'm Anna Nielsen, an architect working with design management. You have so much room to create something that genuinely is a full vision. We can integrate latest technology and trying to minimize the footprint. Placemaking to me is about creating a community. A customer journey, a destination that people will want to visit again and again. Hi Philip, it's a great pleasure to finally meet you and hear more about this stunning masterpiece. So we've got a 1.2 million square meter master plan. We've got two really key and completely distinct assets, which is this vault structure here, which is a man-made carved village that sits within the hillside itself. And you can see in the centerpiece here, we have this new, brand new freshwater lake. The master plan is composed of six different districts or clusters, yeah. which each have their own unique character. So this is our ski village, and this really showcases what the mountain's all about. It was a combination of nature and developing the natural landscapes with unbelievable assets like this. And another one of our amazing and extraordinary assets, this, this new man-made lake. So we're creating this, uh, this new bow structure. People will be able to uh, live and enjoy the internal spaces of the bow. The lake itself is just under three kilometers long. It's filled with fresh water. Beautiful, that's stunning. And then finally, it's worth having a, a closer look at the internal spaces of the vault, which is inserted into the mountainscape itself. We have hospitality uh, assets, we have homes so people can live in here. It also forms the arrival point and the gateway for our mountain development. Totally unique around the world, actually. Thank you very much for your time and thank you very much for explaining all the massive details about this amazing masterpiece. Great pleasure. And I can't wait to be one of the first people to visit Trudeau. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. Thank you. Thank you. We had a great time yesterday at the mountains and I really enjoyed every moment. I'm really excited to know more about the project uh, today. So Nadim, can you yes. tell us more about your roles and responsibilities here at Regena and what persuaded you to join NEO? I'm part of the development team. So we work extensively on uh, destination creation and integration. Trojena and Neom in general is something that hasn't existed before. You're always yeah. going in to add something, but when you're here creating it from scratch, yes. you have so much room to create something that genuinely is a full vision. And I think that's what's driving me forward. Fantastic. Anna, what about you? Well, I've always been intrigued by the life of the city. Yeah. So that made it very natural for me to become an architect. And I wanted to be a part of creating something people have never seen before and push the boundaries. We can integrate the latest technology and trying to minimize the footprint will really create something new and unique. Fantastic. Nadim, how will the way Trojena is built disrupt the industry norms? Predominantly from it being a no-car zone, from a land mobility perspective, uh, in addition to the way commercial activities are interacted with. So from your progression to the mountain, to your entry point, to your discovery of the different phases of the project, you'll be able to have amazing visuals in front of you in any direction you look. You'll be faced with cutting edge technology. It will, it will be something to blow people away. It's also about, we not only want to create this amazing destination, we would like to create a community that people want to come back to. This is a place for people to meet and change experiences. The way Trojana is being set up, particularly with the integration of technology, will enable people to work from anywhere. And I think it would grant them the access to feel free to live in this place, as well as being able to conduct everything they need to do in their lives in one from place. this location. Oh, beautiful. Yeah, yeah. Amazing. So up at the mountain, it's 10 degrees cooler than the rest of the Neom. Oh, yeah. It will be a perfect summer destination with a perfect temperature, 
And in combination with all of these activities, it's a unique offering. So 96% of Trojana is preserved landscape. We're also working with enhancing what's already there. And then a small portion, we're working with reimagining the landscape and the offering of the mountain. Nadim, how does Trojana fit in the bigger master plan for Neom and the Saudi Vision 2030? Uh, with regards to Vision 2030, we are looking at creating a vibrant society that is efficient and integrated. So I think it's essential that not only are we focusing on domestic regional visitors and, and re potential residents, but we should also think about the whole world as a potential market for people to come and visit and enjoy and understand what, what the region and Greater Neom is all about. I think what we're doing in Chajenna is something that hopefully can inspire other teams. An open culture where you're allowed to bring forward new ideas, engage with people and trying to get all of these powerful knowledge yeah. combined into a project that will, will change the destination creation for a lot of places as well. Nadim, final question. Which of the 100 plus activities available here at Trojana you're excited the most and why? Personally, I've always been a very big fan of the outdoors, particularly yeah. camping. So you'll be able to have a very comfortable experience while still experiencing amazing nature and the outdoors. Wow. If you look at the stars at night, yeah. it's, it's something very impressive mm. to look at. Yeah. I'm really excited about the skiing. We're going to have the first outdoor ski slopes in Saudi Arabia wow. with real snow. And wow. uh, now in January, we had snowfall coming down and you could see everybody going up with their cars to the mountain just to play with the snow yeah. is something I'm super excited about. Super, fantastic. Thank you guys for your time. It was a great pleasure to know more uh, about Trojana, this project that uh, we are all waiting for to see.